Unit 1. School Clubs. Hello and welcome back to Online Learning with me, Teacher Carlos. I hope everyone is doing great today. We will get started on our third, that is three, third uh, video lesson. So this is our third video lesson. And before we get started on our, on our book, come on, let's go student book. I would like us to review our Come On song. So, are you guys ready for the song? All right, here we go. So let's practice this song and hopefully you'll have it remembered by this time. All right, one, two, ready and go. Great job, everyone. I'm sure everyone is singing uh, to their best abilities, and I hope you like this song. So hopefully uh, you'll remember this song and remember all the characters in our book, because the characters are going to appear in our stories. Okay, so before we move on, I want to do a bit of a review. So I want to review our vocabulary words of our favorite school clubs. Okay, so here comes the first picture. Uh, we will do this more quickly, more quickly, because we do have more vocabulary words for you to learn. Okay, so take a look at this picture. And if you said, the music club that is correct so that is the music club take a look at this picture this picture is the drama club drama club very good <clears throat> this next picture is what is that that is correct that is the yoga club yoga club very good. The next picture, next flashcard, you should know this here. This is the knitting club. Knitting club. Okay. Next one is, this one is the robotics club. Robotics club. And the last school club we have here, you guys should be familiar with this one. This is the magic club that is the magic club very good job guys hope hope we can remember that and if you do remember great job you're doing a good good job so far okay now let's go ahead and open our student books so that is our come on student books and you want to turn to page eight page eight Page 8 <clears throat> has a new set of vocabulary words. These are at the activities, the club activities you do in each school club. So let's go ahead and take a look at this picture. Okay, I'll let you take a minute. <clears throat> and let's go ahead and start with the letter A, letter A, 
Lesson two, club activities. So, if you look at the first picture there, let, let number one, letter A. So, in this club, you do yoga. So, that is the yoga club, right? So, number one, do yoga. So, what do you do in yoga club? You do yoga. Very good. Okay, number two. So it looks like there is a girl playing a violin. So that is number two. Play instruments. Play instruments. <clears throat> Which club do you play instruments in? Correct. The music club. Number three. Number three. You see a boy with a with a pretend knife and a costume. He is wearing a costume. Number three, perform in plays. So which club do you perform in plays? <clears throat> that is the drama club. Very good. Drama club. And number four, you see a girl there and she is making a glove. She is she is knitting gloves. So number four, knit gloves. Which club do you knit gloves in? So that is the knitting glove club. Very good. Number five. Number five, you see there a boy playing with a robot. So in which club do you build robots? Build robots. Which club do you build robots? That is the robotics club. Very good. And the last one here we have do magic tricks. Number six, do magic tricks. Which club do you do magic tricks? That is the magic club. Magic club. Very good. Very good. <clears throat> okay, so now we are going to practice how to ask one person if they like to do these activities. So if we look below the flashcards or below the club activities, you see a question. The question is, do you like to do yoga? Question mark. Do you like to do yoga? So there's two different answers. Yes and no. Yes, if you do like to do yoga, you would say, yes, I do, period, full stop. The other answer is, no, I don't. So let's take a look at these sentences. Again, do you like to do yoga? Do you like to play instruments? Do you like to perform in plays. Do you like to knit gloves? Number five for build robots. Do you like to build robots? And not the last one. Do you like to do magic tricks? So let's go ahead and review those on your own. So all of these answers, it's up to you if you like you say, yes, I do. If you do not like, you say, no, I don't. Very good. Okay, so let's go ahead and review these new club activities. So these are your new vocabulary words. Your first words were clubs, school clubs. These new words are the club activities, the things you do in your club. So what you do in the school club. So in the yoga club, you do yoga, for example. Okay, so I am going to show you a new, a new flashcard, and you give me the question. How do you ask someone if they like to do that activity? Okay, here is the first flashcard. Can you give me the question to go with this activity, this club activity? Okay, if you said, do you like to do yoga? 
That is correct. Do you like to do yoga? Very good. Next flashcard here. Can you give me the question? The question is, do you like to play instruments? Very good. The next flashcard here. It looks like someone is on a stage. <clears throat> so, this is the drama club. So, what activity do they do in the drama club? If you ask the question, do you like to perform in plays? That is correct. Good job. Next flashcard here. We have somebody making a glove or knitting a glove. So the question should be, do you like to knit gloves? Great job. Next one here has a robot included. So the question should be, do you like to build robots? Very good. And the last one, we have a rabbit. The last flashcard, we have a rabbit coming out of a hat. So the question should be, do you like to do magic tricks? Very good. So please review these questions and remember the answers are very easy. Yes, I do or no, I don't. Good job. Let's move on to the next section. Great. So let's move on to letter B. We're going to move on to letter B on page 8. So this time, we are going to ask whether or not these students like to do the club activity. So instead of using I or you, we're going to be using he or she, the pronouns he or she, depending if it's a boy or a girl. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. <clears throat> let's take a look at number one. So number one, we have a boy. And the boy is dressed up as a character. So it looks like he is in the drama club. So let's ask if he likes to do that club activity. So the question should be, does not do when we use he or she do becomes does so does he like to perform in plays does he like to perform in plays so take a look at the picture and look at his face his face is he happy or not happy is he sad it looks like he is sad and look what he is thinking. He is thinking about knitting gloves. So the answer is no, he doesn't. He likes to knit gloves. If he had a happy face and wearing the costume, performing in plays, if he was happy, then the answer would be yes, he does. Remember, when we use pronouns he or she, it is does, not do. We use do for you and I. Do for you and I. For he and she, we use does. We use does. So, does he like to perform in plays? No, he doesn't. Does not. Doesn't. He likes to knit gloves. One more thing. The verb to like, like, chop, chop my, like, chop. <clears throat> so we use, we put an S at the end of like whenever we use pronouns like he or she. She likes to knit gloves. He likes to perform in plays. So that like has an S at the end. Okay, let's go on to number two. Number two 
It is a boy. I'm sorry, a girl. Number two, it is a girl. And it looks like she likes to be in the knitting club. So the question is, does she like, no S, because it is a question mark. Does she like to knit gloves? Does she like to knit gloves? So, yes, she does. Yes, she likes to knit gloves. Very good. Number three, number three, the boy is playing an instrument. He is playing a piano. So the question should be, does he like to play instruments? Very good. Does he like to play instruments? It looks like he does not. Because in his mind, he is thinking about robots. He's thinking about the robotics club. So, does he like to play instrument? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. He likes to build robots. He likes to build robots. Very good. Number four. Number four, we have a girl. The girl is in yoga club. So, the question is, does she like to do yoga? Does she like to do yoga? No, she doesn't. She does not like to do yoga. What does she like? She likes to play instruments because she is playing a guitar. She is playing a guitar. Number five. Number five, it is a girl. She is making or building a robot. So the question is, does she like to build robots? And the answer is, look at the picture there. Yes, she does. She likes to play with robots. And number six, number six is the last one about the boy pull pulling a rabbit out of a hat. So the question is, does he like to do magic tricks? And the answer for that is yes. Yes, he does. He likes to do magic tricks. Very good, guys. I'm glad you guys are learning this. And I hope you practice how to answer and how to question, how to make a question and answer. Great, guys. And I hope you enjoyed your time here. Uh, make sure uh, we are working on our workbook to do the exercises. So the workbook uh, is the other come on book where you would go ahead and complete each exercises. So go ahead and complete lessons one and two on your workbook. Lessons one and two. That would be page two three, four, and five. So that's lesson one and two. Club activities and school clubs. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you on the next online video lessons with me, Teacher Carlos. Have a great day.